Loose lips sink ships. This old saying has been passed down from generation to generation, and for good reason. It is a reminder that sometimes, the less you say, the better. Unfortunately, many of us have not learned this lesson, and we end up talking too much and getting ourselves into trouble. This is the problem that we will be discussing today, the dangers of talking too much, and the benefits of keeping quiet. Let me start with a story. A few years ago, a friend of mine was going through a messy divorce. He was angry and bitter, and he couldn't help but talk about it to anyone who would listen. He would vent about his ex-wife, her lawyers, the judge, and anyone else involved in the case. He didn't realize that some of the people he was talking to were actually friends of his ex-wife, and they were passing on everything he said. Eventually, his ex-wife's lawyers got hold of some of the things he had said, and they used them against him in court. In the end, he lost custody of his children, and he ended up paying a hefty sum in alimony. This is just one example of how talking too much can get you into trouble. The problem is that we live in a society that values talking. We are encouraged to express our opinions, to speak our minds, and to be heard. Social media has made this even worse, as we are now expected to share every thought and feeling we have with the world. But the truth is that talking too much can be dangerous. It can lead to misunderstandings, hurt feelings, and even legal trouble. So, what can we do to avoid these pitfalls? The answer is simple. We need to learn to keep our mouths shut. There is a lot of power in silence, and there are many benefits to learning to listen more than we speak. One real-life example of this is Mahatma Gandhi. Gandhi was known for his powerful speeches and his ability to inspire people with his words. But he was also a man of great silence. He would spend hours each day in meditation and contemplation, and he would often go for days without speaking. He believed that silence was a powerful tool for personal growth and that it could help us to connect with our inner selves and find a deeper sense of purpose. There is some science to back up this idea as well. Research has shown that people who talk less are generally more well-liked than those who talk too much. They are seen as being more intelligent, more thoughtful, and more trustworthy. This is because people who talk less tend to listen more, and they are better able to understand the needs and concerns of others. For example, if you are in a job interview or a business meeting, it is always better to listen more than you speak. This shows that you are interested in what the other person has to say and that you are willing to learn from them. It also gives you the opportunity to gather more information and make a more informed decision. Another thing is that it is often better to keep your opinions to yourself, especially when it comes to controversial topics like politics or religion. This is not to say that you should never express your opinions, but rather that you should be careful about when and where you do so. Expressing your opinions in the wrong setting can lead to misunderstandings and hurt feelings, and it can even damage your relationships with others or get yourself into some serious trouble. So, there are many benefits to learning to keep our mouths shut. We can avoid misunderstandings, legal trouble, and hurt feelings. We can also improve our relationships with others and find a deeper sense of purpose within ourselves. As Lao Tzu said, silence is a source of great strength. It's important to note that there are times when speaking up is necessary. There are times when we need to use our voices to advocate for ourselves and for others. But even in those situations, it's important to choose our words carefully and to speak with intention. As Mahatma Gandhi once said, speak only if it improves upon the silence. So let us all take a moment to pause, listen, and think before we speak. 
And let us remember that sometimes, the less we say, the better. If you found this video helpful, please share it with your friends and family. And let us know in the comments how you plan to apply these lessons to your own life. Remember, the power of silence is in your hand. Thanks for watching. More wisdom, more solution, better life.